So hello folks, this is the 2021 October November paper 13 and the question number is 30. It is concerned with the chapter superposition of waves and its diffraction of course. A ray of a green light is incident normally on a diffraction grating, grating here. Several bright spots are produced on a screen on the other side of the grating, of the grating here as shown. Which pair of changes could result in bright spots at exactly the same angles as previously? So we have to find which pair of changes here could result in bright spots at exactly the same angle. So we have the equation here for a diffraction grating we should have uh, at any bright spot we should be d sine theta is equal to n into lambda. D sine theta. So d is the uh, grating space, the distance between one one grid to another grid, one grating to another grating. And this d is equal to or equal to 1 by n sine theta is equal to n lambda where n is the number of lines per unit length, number of grating lines per unit length. n is the order of the uh, bright spot, lambda is the wavelength, which gives us sine of theta is equal to n and lambda, and which further gives us theta is equal to sine of inverse n and lambda. So that means theta depends on three things. One is the order for second, third. One is the number of lines per unit length, and another is the wavelength. Now, which could produce the same theta here? So first let us see. Use blue light and in this sense. Use blue light means lambda decrease. Use blue light means lambda decrease. Lambda decrease. And increase the distance between. So this thing is not involved here. The increase of distance. Let us say if I produce the screen here now. Screen here now. This angle does not change. This angle does not change. So that's why this distance has no effect. No effect. If I use blue light, lambda will decrease. So theta will decrease. So here theta decrease. So in the second we have got use blue light. Use blue light means lambda decrease. Theta decrease. And increase the number of lines point length. And increase this. So decrease this and increase this can make same theta. So B seems a feasible choice. Let's say theta same. Let's say theta same. Next use red light. Red light means that lambda is increased. And increase the distance between the so it has no effect so here it will theta will increase theta will increase here next use red light lambda increase and increase the number of lines per unit length so increase this again increase increase it's again increase so theta increase so the only choice that is feasible is choice number b where theta remains same so choice number b should be the correct choice